Every sport makes different demands on an athlete. A soccer player needs to sprint repeatedly for 90 minutes and change direction in a heartbeat. A baseball pitcher needs to turn rotational energy into a blazing fastball. A sprinter needs massive straight line speed and acceleration. Different types of athletes are suited to different types of sports. If you want the absolute best performance, you need to train that athlete to optimize their strong points and minimize their weaknesses. That's what they do at Sparta Sports Science by focusing on the attributes of each individual athlete. The golden question we get a lot is, you know, who's the best athlete? And, and our response tends to be, what's the best painting? My name is Phil Wagner. Uh, I founded Sparta Performance Science in 2008. The tailored approach to evaluating and improving athletes is at the forefront of the sports science world. Wagner has worked with many professional athletes, including Major League All-Star Tyson Ross of the San Diego Padres, as well as Los Angeles Lakers guard Jeremy Lin, helping him go from a marginal NBA player to a phenom. When an athlete comes into Sparta for the first time, a movement signature is captured by performing a vertical jump on a force plate. How we interact with the ground explains so much of how an athlete is in their sport, and it's all based around how you time your movement. Some are shorter and quicker, others are really explosive, and others are just slow and strong. We're looking at how much force is put in the ground initially, and then how well that force is transferred from that initial creation to the final prolonging of force production. The three phases are the load, which is how quickly you can develop that force. The second bar, where you explode, is how well you transfer that force. And the final bar is how long you produce force or your drive. You want it to be relatively level, and the number one risk is any signature where one value is exceptionally high. We see baseball players with an extreme drive because most of their movements tend to be producing force for a longer period of time. If they don't have enough load to initiate that force, we've been able to statistically associate it with elbow injuries. We'll give squats to that player to improve their load, but still have that drive there at the end to create that rotational movement. Over time, as a weight increases on a certain movement because you're getting better at it, your force plate signature changes in a certain way as well. And so we've associated the two trajectories of the exercise improvement and the force plate improvement and start coming up with a true treatment plan that's based off evidence. I've been you know, plagued by injuries uh, majority of my career. I've had three knee surgeries. And, and since working with Phil and Sparta, um, I, I found out why and, and how to protect myself as well as, as trying to get better. We've seen more and more personalization in every aspect of our lives. By applying that same mindset, one that almost seems like part of Silicon Valley to the sports world, Sparta is helping each of its athletes to try and realize their full potential.